Also this week at a workshop in Abuja Discussion Center on developing a template for multi-sectoral implementation of some sections of the Administration of Criminal Justice Act. Please take a listen. Thank you very much. We think I see. The Federal Ministry of Justice, in collaboration with the Nigerian police and other stakeholders in the criminal justice system, are planning a national crime and incidents database to connect all parts of the country. This gathering is to help in that plan. The Solicitor General of the Federation takes to the podium, given reasons for the workshop. Participants at this workshop represent the high echelon of the critical stakeholders in criminal administration. We will present the tracking templates for adoption and implementation status at, of the Act 2015 and the Administration of Justice by the various states. Your input will no doubt enrich the templates while the validation and adoption of templates will ensure its general application by those charged with the implementation of the Act. Representatives of security agencies at the workshop highlight the roles of security agencies as stated in the ACJA Act 2015. The bottom line thus is to provide justice for the suspect, the defendant, and the victim, and by implication for the state at large. The success of any system of criminal justice administration depends on how efficient the institutions involved in criminal de justice delivery perform the responsibility imposed upon them by law. It is pertinent to observe that Section 1.1 of the Act imposes a duty on all criminal justice institutions to ensure compliance with the provisions of the law. The law envisages that all justice institutions work in synergy as a unit for the purpose of achieving its set objectives. The Nigerian Customs Service is saddled with a core statutory responsibility of revenue collection, accounting for same, and anti-smuggling activities in addition to other functions which include security, security functions, generating statistics for planning and budgetary purposes. This is indeed a welcome development which would in no small measure standardize the arrest and detention area of our, our, of our anti smuggling activity for a more effective service delivery and economic development. Some experts want collaboration with traditional and non-formal justice delivery system if Nigeria is to achieve its goal of adequate justice delivery. Sometimes it is not about legislation, it's not about infrastructure, it's not about facilities, it is about us actors in the system. How do we conduct ourselves? What level of commitment do we have? Do we take advantage of the system? and prevent it from working. Now, again, the intention is not to point fingers on any particular institution, because some of the negative practices that cause these delays by us, examples co could be cited from all institutions. The implementation of the Administration of Criminal Justice Act 2015 is expected to strengthen the synergy between the judiciary and security agencies.